bro. Who's doing Yo, that? Oh, welcome to AWT, and it's, it's episode 11, I believe, right? Right, right? I think it is. Yeah. Um, And yeah, we're going to be talking about miscellaneous bullshit that we all seem to not really even care about, but yeah, we're going to talk about it. Here we go. Absolutely. So, what is the first thing you guys want to talk about? We can talk about Turd Island, actually. So, yesterday we were talking, uh, we had Turd Island, Ace Howard versus AJ versus. So actually, no, Sam, yeah, dude, what, how do you guys dude, think about that? What do you guys think about that? I just I just got the video out. By the time you guys see this, it's already out on the channel. Yeah, I'm, done. I'm not going to lie. It I'm is... not going to lie. The biggest criticism ah. is all they really did to each other was call each other fat. But Samuel was like saying, Leia, I don't like you. You're fat. And then Leia's like, oh, yeah, you want to call me fat. You're fat. <laughs> it was kind of gay. <laughs> right, Leia? Yeah. And gay. there was looping on the Nazi point because even yes. though they didn't explain the Nazi point well, there was a lot of looping there for sure. It really was. You that know was what, like actually, pretty much most of it. Because you know what actually so, made me no. mad, though? Hmm. What? AJ I fell fucking... asleep. Dude, <laughs> AJ <laughs> lied to us. What do you but mean? What? But the face stocks, bro. What do you mean? Oh, no, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, because yep. it wasn't yep. actually, it wasn't actually AJ, it was Quackity. On Skibbity Toilet, according yeah. to Ace Heller and Samuel. <sighs> but, but I also had, like, Robin told me, and Robin, I do think is a trusted source, that Ace is lying. So I don't really know who's telling the truth in this, because Robin's saying he's in the GC, he says, in that GC, LTB sent AJ's face docs with that other YouTuber. So even Robin's saying it's AJ. Hmm. So, uh, it's, so that's why like, that's why I'm not gonna say like a definitive. Oh, AJ's lying. Oh, Someone's like, probably missing the line. Okay. I don't yeah, know. But... I don't know if AJ is lying, but it does seem like AJ did get spooked because I believe, and AJ and Robin have confirmed this to me. LTBs did send AJ's face docs in AJ's DMs as a threat. Wow. So I wouldn't be surprised in this group chat that Robin's in, where Robin's telling me, yes, that's actually AJ's face. I don't know. <laughs> I think that whole Turd Island was a lot of he said, she said. Like, I don't know if anybody else felt that way, but it yeah. was like, oh, well, this happened. Oh, well, this didn't happen. Or and like, oh, but no, you're lying. No, you're lying. And that's why Samuel is in the fork. Because he's, well, uh, but Ace got, but, but, but that's why Ace like kind of had to walk back because Ace said there was no group chat until I said that I well I, when AJ brought up the group chat and like oh you mean that group chat so even Ace wasn't really telling the truth on what group chat we were talking about and then he goes no that was just quackity but that's the same group chat Robin is probably now kicked out of not gonna lie where he says no in that GC. Uh, he says Ace is lying, and that GC LTBs did send Ace's face docs to that other YouTuber. You mean mm -hmm. AJ's? Yes, AJ's, yes. Did it feel to anyone else that Ace and Samuel had two, uh, not to go on the Nazi thing, but they had two very different arguments for the Nazi thing, whereas an Ace was saying, like, oh, it was just a joke because AJ told us this, and it was a joke. And Samuel was like, no, AJ told me this, so I put it in the video because it's a real thing. Like, well, I, he, I, he thought it was a joke too, and I think he he okay. uh, he did say that. And during there, I just think it was overlooked. Okay, yeah. See, I didn't hear it, but that that's why I'm asking, like, if anybody else, because I missed that. Yeah. So for mm -hmm. me, I heard two very different stories. But if that's and the my case, then, yeah. and my point against fucking Ace, and I wish uh, we didn't go to Tony. I'm that's a little criticism for you, fucking flatly, that we should have just kept Tony out when Amos came in. Um, but like, because yeah, because these guys are the big anti doxers like they think doxing is doxing, and I brought up the point multiple times that Ace really couldn't have an answer for why I kick out AJ for an accident, but keep LTBs for threatening. Oh right, right, like, right, right. I mean, like you're the you're the big anti doxing people. Like it, you mean you kicked out AJ for an accident, and but this guy is going into the fucking DMs and these group chats, sending his face to people, and that's perfectly okay. Mm -hmm. I don't yeah, know. they're critical. For sure, for sure. I mean, I <laughs> what, what AJ did wasn't malicious. What LT Beast is doing is actively malicious. <laughs> and Amos, too, which I wish again, flatly, Tony just stayed out of the fucking chat. <laughs> Amos also <laughs> was releasing personal information about fucking AJ. Just willy-nilly in these fucking fucking VCs. Like, I didn't know what 
AJ was doing for his college. Now I do. <laughs> I think, uh, personally, a, a lot of it for me, not knowing the whole Ace Howler, Samuel, AJ stuff, other than I still stand by AJ's just as uh, obsessed with them as mm -hmm. they are with him. Because how many times have we heard AJ talk about them? True, he just brings them up out of nowhere, dude. Yeah. yeah. Just like, uh, okay, and? It's very true. He brings them up <laughs> all the time. And I'm yeah. just like, dude, okay, you can't complain that they're talking about you when you're talking about them the... in every VC that we're in. Yeah. I'm on the it's same point said... show here, same page, yeah. basically. It's a he said, she said. Because without anybody wanting to share proof, and nobody wanted to share proof, be it AJ or Samuel or any of them, None of them wanted to share proof. It's just he said, she said. So the best course of action is to stop talking about each other and move on. Mm. Show proof, right? Like, AJ says, that's not true. You recorded this call. Well, where's the proof? And on the same end, they're saying, oh, well, AJ was okay with it. Well, where's the proof? Oh, well, he was. Okay, well, where's the proof? Nobody showed any proof that entire Turd Island other than DMs that were uh, cathodic posted. Mm. No, like, but most of the points was just like he said, she, she uh, said bullshit, okay. and it's like Sally sailed she shells by the she shore. The Absolutely, she Peter Piper picked a pack of pickle peppers. <laughs> yeah, why is it always uh, peppers? I don't know. I think I think that's probably the best performance I've had when it comes to a debate. I don't know, dude. It wasn't even like they didn't. They didn't even come at you hard. No, no. They like. I, mean, I dressed the birthday thing. Uh. They do. They address, I, he tried to get me on the birthday thing. I was like, no, our birthdays were not even comparable. I didn't give you stress. I got stress when it comes to Tony. Uh, I came into your stream. You didn't have to bring me in. And also, you kind of begged me to come on, but whatever. And then you fucking bombarded me with Samuel and fucking Amos and five other fucking retarded Spurgs. <laughs> mm -hmm. I gave you content. My content was in danger. <laughs> Well, I've been repaired. It's not even like, like there's no equal there. <laughs> yeah, and I mean, I mean, to be fair to Flatly, in the one case of Tony being on, this was the one that made the most sense because Tony did at YouTube. Mm. Uh, yeah. This is the one that I made the most sense. I just wish that when Amos came on. in, we kept fucking Tony out. Yes, Amos, I agree. I'm not gonna lie, Amos was the fucking more was more than the more of a problem than Ace. Because this guy was more of a problem than Samuel. I would believe that Amos is, is way more than a problem in Samuel now than it was before. Samuel, oh, I do think I, I do th I do I, think Samuel has like cooled off, but it's like this guy. It just seems like Amos, like Amos, is fucking pissed at a at AJ because AJ didn't tell him that he had a fucking secret account on Discord that we all knew about. He's fucking like ass mad, fucking obsessed that AJ didn't fucking tell him that he, like AJ. It, it doesn't even make any fucking sense on why he's mad at AJ for not telling about the secret of well, like his personal because, account on Discord. Probably because he said he was going to take a break, but really he didn't. But that's not. But why would? But why would AJ talk to Amos about that? Amos was gunning for him immediately on that fucking stream after AJ I mean, true, accidentally yeah. doxed. True, true. Yeah. It's like, oh, I'm gonna talk. Oh, I'm I'm taking a break, and I'm gonna give my enemy my fucking secret Discord. No. <laughs> well, at that time, from my understanding, from what like Ace Haller has told me, um, they didn't weren't really like going to cut him off after that. It was when uh he the whole um situation where they were trying to give him advice on after the whole situation, and they were telling him to leave the internet, right, and. He came to us in the VC and was spewing it like they were trying to scare him offline, yada, yada, yada. But we didn't know the full context of the fact that his family was whole doxed. It wasn't just him. It was his whole family. So we didn't know that. I would probably advise probably staying off longer if I had known that his family was doxed. Well, that's what you get for fucking with a hacker group. I don't have to tell you. But apparently <laughs> after that, because he... Uh, came to us and I guess changed to, like how they I supposedly allegedly uh, came about the situation was wrong and that's apparently why you know they all cut him off because of that. That's I'm sorry, but that doesn't make any sense because after uh, that stream, Amos and the rest of them cut him off on that birthday stream. They cut him off immediately. And then when I debated them on that first, well, now on on the Frosty stream where like he actually doxed someone, 
they did cut him off. And when I confronted him on that on the birthday stream, they basically confirmed him, they cut him off. So, and this the birthday streams before AJ fucked with the hacker group, which, in my opinion, I think he fucked with the hacker group and uh, got hacked and fucking doxxed. They were Why already you... on with him. Okay. Mm, I'm not going to ask that question. Wait, wait, no, wait, fuck it. Why do you think AJ was fucking with the hacker group? I don't know. Like, I. Like, I. This guy doesn't talk that much shit online. I, like, Do you I don't think know. he was... Hold on. I'm going to propose something, and I know, AJ, you're going to watch this. No jab at you, bro. But why the fuck are you talking to a hacker group? And why are you... Were you them fucking with them, right? Were I don't know. To, I, were you I, trying I, to get defend, their shit? I'm just going to defend AJ. Uh, not to directly counteract you, but like a thought. Yeah. I think you're right. Oh, yeah, no. Uh, why the fuck are you in the first place? I think AJ honestly was scared of either not only being attacked, but also being doxxed. You know what I mean? Because mm -hmm. there are people that oh, have done this okay. in this community. But then again, AJ, I, I love you, man, but he doesn't really have the strongest spine. You know what I mean? Hmm. I don't know. I don't. I it's, don't know. It's if kind of a weak. Have a it's not. a weak point. I, I just don't know why out of nowhere, just like randomly, no, he he gets fucking like hacked by this our mind retard. Because okay. I feel like okay, I want to bring up this fact. That, I'm sorry, Joe, for cutting you off. Um, no, you're good. You're good. You're good. Because Go I like with me getting hacked, it was different, right? Okay. Like I just got my Discord hacked, and like they were trying to fucking like go to other people, get their shit, just so they can get money out of people. Him getting hacked was he got hacked on Twitter, he got hacked on Discord. He had his docs like spread throughout Discord and on Twitter. It was a completely different like hack, like a different, a completely different like situation, right? Like, mm. and that's why I'm like, okay, why though? Like, why? How did this happen? How did they get into all of your shit? Mm. Yeah, I just want to add add on to what Flatley said. Like, I agree about the like the general like spinelessness because how many times before leading up to Turd Island did all of us hear AJ go, Well I'm just gonna moderate. I'm not gonna argue. Like I don't want to argue and everything. And we, we all said a lot. And we all said, dude, if they ask you a question or confront you about something, you gotta respond or you're gonna look back. He's like, ah well uh, I'm just there to moderate. And I mean granted on Turd Island he did kind of argue back. He I guess he did a lot either more than he, I thought took, he was gonna do. Yeah. He did way more but he he was willing to go into that to let Burn fight his battle for him. But he's also willing to go in private calls and talk all this shit about Ace and Amos and Samuel and all of them. I don't know. I don't know. Like, AJ, defend yourself, man. It's not that hard. Like, even if it's and I kinda what we cool. said... And I kind of coerced him to fucking defend himself on that turn island. I don't know if that was noticeable. But I was asking him a question, Ace would talk to him, and then, then he would, like, respond. And then would, they would go at it. Because, this, like, to be honest, my points were already basically done. I called him out for hypocrisy on, on doxing. And that, then my problem with Ace was done. <laughs> he, he needs um a core group. And I'm hoping we could be that core group of people to be like, listen, when people are talking shit about you, uh, who the fuck are you? Right? Like, who? Yeah. yeah. Who? Mm. Oh, so and so is making fun of me? Okay, and? That happens to me all the time. Actually, it happens to me a lot more in the Call of Duty Reddit. I'm not going to lie. I get bullied in there, bro. I'm not even going to get bro. They bully me. All right? But it's like, who cares? Who cares? Like, I'll post a sniping clip, and they'll just be shit talking me, and then they'll take my photos from Instagram and stuff like that. And I'd be like, oh, he, this is what he thinks about people. Da, 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 they'll take like weird things from Turd Island or something. And they'll just like make fun of me and stuff, right? Yeah. I just don't say anything back because literally it's only the first day that it's the worst. And the next day, nobody gives a hell. Nobody gives a shit, right? Mm, pretty much. Just, I don't know. I think he needs that core group to be like, listen, bro, either stand on your shit or act like you don't know nobody type thing. Or do both. You know what I mean? I mean, like, we all agree. I think a bunch of us talked about it, and we even told him, like, if you go on Turd Island with the idea that you're just going to moderate and let Burn fight your battles for you, you're going to look bad. If yeah. they say, hey, AJ, this, 
and you don't like he was like, "Oh, I'll respond, but that's it." No, dude, there you know the don't let burn argue for you. You need to be involved because it's about you. If I We'll go hypothetical. Say someone's making accusations or whatever and making fun of me, and I go, hey, by the way, Sliggins, like, Sliggins is like, I'm going to defend Joe, and I go, well, I'll moderate, I'll watch, I'll be there. Everybody be like, Joe's a pussy. He's letting Sliggins make an argument for him. That's, see, that's the same type of shit I would, okay, and I'm, I mean, yeah, I, and you probably I, are, I already <laughs> know which, I'm sorry, Sliggins, um, I already know what this is about to happen after I say this, but I don't give a fuck. But it's the same criticism I gave Huggy. It's the mm-hmm. same criticism. I hold the same criticism mm-hmm. for for really? for AJ. I might have the minority opinion here on Huggy. Recently, I've kind of, I've kind of, I kind of like him. His Twitter, I mean, he's been his Twitter. I don't. His shows are boring, right? Yeah, but his Twitter. Eh? Actually, you know what? No, 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 no. I take that back because I don't know if it was Huggy or Badwick. Never mind. It was Badwick. It was Badwick. percent of it is Badwick. today, too, so I, I wonder how many times I've scrolled past it just to like it. Then it was actually Badwick. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> it is almost always Badwick who's posted yeah. the really funny face shit. Because how, who, who, when have you ever seen Huggy actually say anything shit, shit talking under our post or actually in a VC? I mean, he'll uh, true, true. poke and prod in like our V and our like um in our chats, but he won't do anything. I am here more. for the Huggy versus no, Triton drama. He, though. I need he, to yeah, that's so fire. Huggy, Huggy will talk shit in his own show, show and like talk like all, like like he's a big man, but then when people try to confront him, he go runs and hides and hides in his little cave. Like, like he's done it for like, like it like huggy you're not you're not making yourself look like like you're not making yourself look tough you're just looking like a coward like if you're not going to confront even the smallest of person i mean it's, it just makes you look like a pussy and exactly and i, I don't want to like keep talking about huggy here because this is not what we we're originally talking about this is the final thing this is the only criticism i hold for you huggy it's the only ho- criticism i hold for you and it's the only reason why i don't like being around you because like one time you'll be sucking sucking my cock on some shit next thing i know i'm watching your fucking stream and you're, you're talking shit on on my shit like or on me or like you know what the fuck yep. like he does it to me i mean i see him appear in my chat and then he's like all friendly and like oh aunt this all oh, aunt that all oh, love aunt's mustache and then the next moment i find that he's talking crap on uh with sen on his stream <laughs> it's like dude <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? but okay who the fuck um, is that guy? <laughs> Moving on from that, how did you guys feel about the Leia and Sam versus, dude? How do you guys feel about that? That was fucking it was kind of gay. It was, it was gay. Lots of looping. It was, lots of it was looping. entertaining the first 15 minutes or so, but then it got... Dude, I literally fell asleep like in the middle of them arguing. I mean, bro, Samuel's yeah. only rebuttal was to just call Leia fat. And then Leia's like, dude, you're Which... literally 400 pounds. Like, what else? And then she would like she would go up and bring up like ten other points, and then Sam would be like, "Yeah, I don't give a fuck. You're a woman. You're annoying. Fuck you, you fatty." And I was like, "All right, it's gay." Then Leia would loop, be like, "No, you're literally fat." <laughs> you know what I mean? I love Leia. Oh, and then I think, I think Samuel came, came in Nicholas Diorio a couple times for like no reason. <laughs> I was yeah. just like, wait, no, wait, it was, it was not that, a, yeah. no, it wasn't for no reason. It's because well, yeah, yeah, it's because Leia came at him and said he looks like Nicholas Diorio. Oh, yep, yep, yep. Now I remember. remember and also because Samuel yeah. has a, this big ass hate boner for Nick because Nick blocked him, and uh, oh, Samuel dude. got really yeah because then Samuel got all this feeling because Nick said I don't even know who the fuck you are. Why are you talking? I don't know, and I then I like Ace and Sam. They're they're kind of yeah. Cool. Sam they're seems like cool. he can like at least Sam like, like Sam can like be I guess grounded. Ace I don't know about, but Amos he's like genuinely on. I do okay. I like I, I, I can't yeah, trust him. I, I haven't talked to him much, but the times I've talked to Sam, he's you know especially about the time I talked to him about the ten second part of his video with the AJ video, he conceded on that and was like, yeah, that was fucked up. I shouldn't. I I probably should have done that differently. And that was, like, mainly the criticism I held for the video, right? Because it comes off very shitty when you're calling him a doxer, this, this, and that, in the first, like, 20 to 30, or maybe in the first minute of the video. And then the first last 10 seconds were, like, maybe the majority of the people that watched the video, that first half of the video, are not there for that. And they're, now they have the idea that he's all these things, right? Um, yeah. But he, he's conceded on that. And Ace Howler, all the things that criticized him for, he's 
he's provided either uh, screenshots or he has given me his side of the story. So I feel like they're more credible because they, they instead of trying to deflect and go around the situation, they try to at least give an explanation, right? Uh, I haven't really talked to uh, Amos as much as the rest of them, though, yeah, so... I can't really hold a criticism to them if I don't, you know, know much. I'm just... I, I, I guess I'm more critical of Amos because he's also one... Like, he's more of the anti-doxing. He does the doxing as doxing no matter what shit. But, like, he's, like... The other day when I, like... I did kind of schizo out on you and everyone else about Amos. Like, I thought Ace was recording. But during that, it's because, like, fucking... Amos is just bringing up personal shit about AJ out of the blue to piss AJ off to get him to react. It's like when Yokai fucking docks fucking Tony and Ant you give an ant server to try to get Tony to react. Yeah. Just saying personal fucking shit about Amos that I didn't need to know. Uh Ember didn't need to know. Uh AJ himself didn't need to know that like that didn't need like that didn't need to come out like well, like, I don't care, like, what he's doing for college and what he wants to be as a fucking college and what college he's fucking doing. You know what I mean? Like, all oh, yeah. this guy's this guy's going for this degree. He's going to try to do this in his life. Like, I don't, like, that's personal shit. I don't want to know personal shit. But this yeah. guy is like, oh, this guy, you accidentally doxed this random retard because uh, you didn't look through your shit, AJ. Which uh, AJ already fucking, like, uh, can, like, acknowledged and fucking, like, yeah, that's a fucked up thing I did. But that that's that's too far. But I can say what he's doing for college. I can make fun of what he's doing. I can make fun of his looks, et cetera, et cetera. It's just like this the anti doxing guy seems pretty okay with people doxing AJ and kinda like softball softballing the dox of fucking AJ himself. That's the problem I have with Amos. You can't Wait. be the anti-doxing guy and go around like incur like oh I, I don't think I don't know if LTB is doxing and if it was who cares. <laughs> we didn't get a lot of Amos on Turd Island though. No, because uh, at that time fucking Tony was on and everyone's like oh fuck you Tony Tony Spurks Tony do this, <laughs> which is like to be expected of course. Um. I don't know. I don't know. I think uh, the best way that AJ and all that group can look is, look, we're done with each other. Let's go our separate ways. AJ, don't talk about them anymore. They don't talk about you anymore. I mean, let's be honest. If AJ doesn't say a word about them and he's still getting harassed by them, then he's in the right, right? Like, if he's doing his own thing and they're still fucking harassing him, making videos about him, joking about him, talking about him, it's like, alright, well, you guys lose. Then it goes vice versa. If those guys don't say a word about AJ and he's still bitching and moaning about Samuel and Ace Howler and Amos, regardless of the circumstances. You know, I think it's just I don't know. They're they're all obsessed with each other. And that's a problem we run into this uh in this community specifically, is one person on one side wants to act like that they're the victim, but in general, it's two sides being just as obsessed with the other. Mm. when there's a simple of, okay, I go this way, you go that way, done. And then guess what? Nothing would happen, right? Mm. Uh, that's just the way I feel about it. I'm not going to obsess over somebody. And if they obsess over me, then who's in the right or who's in the wrong, right? Like, I don't care if Bird thinks that I'm the better ginger. I agree. Like, we just agree, you know? I'm the better ginger. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, fuck you. Go fuck yourself. Hey, you're you're facing not the ginger allegations other. anymore. That's true. I don't know. I can, I can take it on the stream, so. Yeah, nah, <laughs> this motherfucker. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about the face reveal. I wish I never did the uh, agreement. What the fuck? Don't make the agreement then, bitch. Having a... Uh... Face reveal remorse right now. It's kind of crazy. Hey guys, I want subscribers. If you give me and my buddy subscribers, I'll show my face. Flash forward, not even thirty minutes to an hour later. I don't know how I feel about that. I should probably take it back. <laughs> the stream. All right, dream. Yeah. What's the point of the mask? Mm. I don't know. I I mean that that stream was funny. I'll. I'll... I don't know. That was a good stream. That was a good stream. I like how Flatlay said the N-word on that stream, so... Oh, I did? 
Yeah. You said, hey, are you Nigerians? And I went, whoa, calm down, buddy. Oh, that was fire. <laughs> dude, that was funny. What did you guys do about the fun. face reveal? It was dope. It was dope, dude. It was, it was dope. Pretty good. Yes, should, I do, should I do more face reveal videos or no? Just not face, face reveal. You should, I'm not, yeah. you, you, you know what I mean, like face cam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you should do, when you're doing your, your gaming streams, I think you should have a yeah. face cam on. Yeah, man. Just for reactions and stuff, you know? Yeah. Dead yeah, air, dead air, dead air, dead air. No, it's not dead air. air. It's it's we took a moment to breathe. I took a moment to breathe. I was, you know, okay. <laughs> At the same time, we're like. <gasps> yeah, we all had to breathe. We all had to take a moment. Like, after seeing Burns' face whip. Like, to take in that moment, like, ooh, you know, like. This is history. This is history. Oh, this is history. We have to breathe, right? Yeah, but, uh. I will say, like, everybody's had some W streams here lately. Like, everybody here has been doing pretty good, not to jerk everybody off, but, like, the Left 4 Dead streams have been a lot of fun. Mm. Uh, Burns, uh, you know, face reveal on Out of Orbit was a lot of fun. Flatley's been covering a lot of good shit lately. His, uh, in particular, I think his D-Max video with uh, him and Peepaw. You know, the Peepaw D-Max video was really good. I really liked it. Sliggins, uh, my... he's been grinding that content for sure. My latest got... stream, bro, is wretched, bro. I... <laughs> <laughs> I, I did it on Pampered Shoe. It was a terrible mm. idea. The only person idea. who has not put out a good stream lately is Given Ant because he decided to dress up in like white cloak for some reason and start talking about like <laughs> yeah, Christianity about, and how bro? certain races are not yeah, okay. Yeah, I didn't true. stand by that. What is that about? That's true. Bro? That's true. You're, you're I saw like him building a cross and putting it in somebody's yard. Like stars, bro. What is that about? Yeah, you live on fire. I also was <laughs> eating chicken and watermelon as well. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, what this the guy, fuck? Bro. It was delicious. Some KFC and some Popeyes. We got a high KFC intake individual here. Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, what, Aunt, what is this tweet that you were talking about? I hate basketball Americans. What does that mean? <laughs> oh, you know. Just, oh, we're going to have to was... censor this episode so uh, fucking bad, which means Flatley's not going to censor it at all. He's not going to censor it at all. This gonna, is going to go gonna out. Have to, I have to censor out the swear words in the beginning, though, if that's about it. <laughs> Oh, Flatly, every episode you go, I gotta censor that, and then we watch the full <laughs> episode. Does. There's and not a single one. Like, I gotta go back and find this, and then I'll go and find it, and I'm like, ah. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> there are multiple times in an episode where Flatly's like, I gotta go back and censor that, and then we watch the full episode, and like, he didn't censor that. No, there was no censoring <laughs> that not, ever happened. It <laughs> if I said it, I said it. <laughs> oh, there's a way that I can censor this out. I guess we could talk about uh delete uh because we talked about D Max and Peepaw. Uh do you guys think D Max is lying about the nineteen hour uh if it yeah. takes you nineteen hours yep. to make a fucking to edit a one hour stream segment? <laughs> Fuck we, uh, we... I, I just think he just fucking horrible at his job. Yeah. I don't think I don't think getting paid for a nap should be part of the tucket. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like all oh, my timesheet. Oh, I took a two-hour nap. Put that to the month. <laughs> That's I made mac and cheese at three forty-five in the morning. <laughs> oh, I yeah, did a right. gaming stream at nine a.m. Yeah, I, <laughs> cried, I cried about Dragon Ball Z animator dying. I cried about that for hey, a little bit. Fucking pussy that shit. Don't... That's pussy That's shit. Like I agree. Criticism. No, it's pussy <laughs> shit. No, it's gay criticism. Dude, have you seen Maggots burging? That's. <laughs> When that has it, maggots first. Dude, try and W yeah. though. Try and W. Oh fuck. Hey, tweet. No. You guys are attacking someone's little girlfriend. Obviously, she's gonna defend D Max because that's her boyfriend. And I was like, Yo, W try and because not only did maggot like that, she was finally. She I forgot what she said, but she, it was basically along the lines of finally somebody with a sensibility. And I was like, Yo, W try w, try and is getting that e pussy lately, bro. And like, do you see that selfie you got? He's smoking a cigarette, saying, "Yo, about to go out and party." Yo, shit, bro. Facts, he's on bro. W mode right now. He's Andrew Tate Arc Triton, bro. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. I'm like Triton, you little stupid little fuck. How dare you? <laughs> How dare you try to throw your hat in the ring with me? But then I see that the or that um, Maga edits likes it, and then it's like, yeah, yeah. I'm like, dude, no fucking way. D Max got cucks by Triton, bro. There's no fucking <laughs> way. Bro. We love cucks. Holy shit. I don't know, I so I guys, I'm expunged from all criticism because I'm somebody's husband. 
Just like how just like how Mega Edits is expunged from all criticism because she's somebody's girlfriend. I am now expunged because true. I'm somebody's husband. Let's go. True, oh, yeah. true. I got a cleaver. I just thought it was weird because I watched, I, and this is actually fresh for me because I listened to it today. I thought it was weird how DMAX was doing like this double double thing where he's like, I'm not going to claim that I was wrong or say that I was wrong, but I wish everybody well and I love all these people who have criticized me. And But I'm not I wrong. I love Magnetar. didn't love Magnetar yeah. very much. Yeah. Today. He, he, like, what was his point? He said, there's no point in addressing that because I, I believe at the time I was right and I don't have any regrets. Yeah, that's it's like, so no, bro, you just admit you were wrong. You're wrong, bro. You know now you're wrong. There's a difference between, like, having regrets or not having regrets and going, at that moment, I firmly believed it, but later I was proven wrong and going, yeah, I was wrong about that. And... It, he he turned it into this whole well. I'm not the cutout for drama. I thought I was one of those guys, but I'm mm -hmm. not, bro. When you were riding high on now recording, and everybody loved you, and you were on clear as mud, and everybody loved you, and you were this this guy that the multiple people in the community, like most of the community, looked up to. It was fine, but the moment you fucked up, all of a sudden it's a problem, and now you're doubling, tripling, quadrupling down. Like don't go on someone's stream and say. Well, you know what? I, I I don't regret what I did and you know what Keemstar fucked me over and all just dude, for someone who says they don't want like all the attention and don't want to be involved, you brought all the Keemstar local stuff on yourself because you brought it up. No one else brought it up, you did. There's people that did that actually. Yeah, and then uh Cause Keem Max responded came. to it right away. None of them could have responded to it. Like, literally, it all dies if you stop responding to it. And then they hit it, True. oh, damned if I do, damned if I don't. Like, well, yeah, you need to apologize to Magnetar. You're still going to get handed that L because you still, to this day, believe that you are, you're not going to say you're wrong. You, you think it was a bad take or whatever. You guys, it's it's fucking ridiculous. Uh, what is the other thing? Oh, a uh, a forced apology is not a real apology. Okay, it doesn't take It doesn't take that much of your person to be like, hey, I was wrong and I apologize for painting you in this light. Like, if you don't feel that way, you're just a narcissistic piece of shit. Like that that's all there is to say to it. Like how are you way, not, you you painted this person as a scammer, taking people's money and scamming them. That is vile, right? Yep. And he yeah. gave it back and everything like that. And you're like, Well, it's not an apology if I'm not actually sorry about it. I'm like, Well why then why say anything in the first place if you're gonna be so vile and vindictive? You play that card, you can't be upset with the repercussions of playing that card because every time you throw your hat in the ring, people are going to know you as the vindictive person. You're vile. You're, you know, miscreant type shit, right? Right. Yep. So you're going to get but, handed that card every single time. By the way, D-Max, I'll admit you didn't bring it up. They told me people. I, like, didn't even think about it. I said something that was false. Hey, D-Max, I was wrong. I said the wrong thing. I was wrong. Oh, shit. It's not that hard to do. I was wrong. People brought it up. You didn't. People was the one who made that argument. I was misinformed uh, and thought that know. you had brought it up originally. Uh, I take the L on that. I was wrong. Can I, can I, I was wrong. Can I, can I say um, something? Can I say something? I mean, yeah, people started it, but it didn't help when like D Max accused every like he did his like his fucking eighteen like page essay on Low Cal Live and then posted his timestamps. People didn't do that. <laughs> That's what I saw originally, so I assumed that D-Max had brought it up, but if I'm wrong, I'm wrong, right? If people like, uh, brought it up first, but that's what I saw was the Yeah, D people brought it up first. first, but then, like, D-Max added to it, throwing his hat in the ring, trying to get yeah. an own on Keemstar about underpaying him, when in reality, it's fucking D-Max. Dude, okay, okay, bro, money. he's being, he's paying, getting paid a lot if he was getting paid 2K. Holy mm. shit, dude. That's a good paycheck. That's fucking fat. Well, Jesus Christ. Is it a month or bi-weekly? Because if you need 2K by, Okay, okay, never mind. 2K a month, a month is actually I make, I make more than that. Yeah, month. I was going to say, never mind, month. never mind. Actually, 2K a month is shit. Never mind. But to edit, at the time, there were no shorts or anything. To edit, <laughs> what? One video a week, and then you could have a side, like, your actual main job or whatever? No, that's good pay. To edit one video a week. Because they Honestly, weren't even doing live at the time. They weren't doing do lives one at the day. time. You could edit the exactly. you could edit the episode and then edit all the shorts for the following week. 
Okay, you yeah. Five like, shorts? I don't know, bro. Like, so, like, okay. I'm not. I'm not even. I'm not even trying to bring up my content, but like, so the there was there was a four hour stream that in a in a three or a two hour stream and almost a four hour stream that I cut down and made into a in a total of a four hours uh a a vod, dude. That took me about like maybe five hours of just trying to censor some things and like cut down things to make it less boring and obviously cut out things that obviously I don't think that would obviously get my channel taken down it took me about like five hours you know like uh, 19 hours what the fuck dude 19 hours it should be the the vod the the shorts the and 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 the fucking the thumbnail and it should be even less than 19 hours out of all that that's crazy connor had more responsibility than dmx because at the time they weren't even doing live shows they were doing what one episode a week something like that yeah yeah, all he had to do was add an episode a week. There were no shorts at the time. And if you have, like, obviously 2000 a month, depending on where you live, isn't enough to sustain yourself. But if you have a job, and D-Max claims he works on films and stuff, you know, I'm not even trying to be that guy, but he's like, I've worked on films, I do all this, I'll do that. Okay, well, edit a few hours of locale. That's an extra two grand in your pocket, you know, do it every week. And then do your actual job. Dude, that's an extra two grand for a a few hours extra every month of editing. And you get plus what you're making from your regular job. Bro, you're in the gold. Two grand. If I had a hobby that paid me two grand. If I streamed and I got paid two grand on top of my job, I'd be like, oh, bro, it's, it's over. It's so over. Rent. Power. Doesn't even matter. I can just stream for that. My job, I don't pay for every like groceries. Eh, don't matter. I'm gonna go to fucking uh, Biloxi, Mississippi, and go gamble at the fuck casino because I can. D- I I don't understand why D Max was like trying to bite the hand that feeds him, and he goes, "Oh, well, Nick defended me and all." But he's trying to claim like everybody tried to jip him out when if anybody got actually got jipped out, it was Connor because Connor got added a bunch of extra responsibilities an editor should not have, like making a docket and shit. Still did it, made a great edit, great show, gave Keemstar content to use on the show, and then Keem's ego got big. D Max, no, no. Nobody knew until later that you were the editor. What? What? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, okay, okay. I think I think we're uh, I think we all most of us. Does anybody else have anything else to say on this D Max? This D Max stuff. No. Um, even the people stuff. D Max, you're not above commentary. Okay, you keep trying to pull this thing. Oh, I'm above these people. No, it's not true. Stop it. Thank but he you. loves us all, bro. He loves you, Sliggins. Does your dad love you more I, I than mean, D-Max? Nah, I think my da- I think my dad likes D-Max better, but you know it'd be like mm-hmm. that sometimes. No, I'm just kidding. True. Okay. Oh. Talk about your dad. Okay. <laughs> no, <laughs> what the fuck? No, Damn, no, bro. I'm not <laughs> bring any bring no. fathers in this. Okay, guys. I think that's, I think that's what we really have on that topic. Okay, uh, I, I, I have I, one more wanna... thing. I have okay, one more what, thing. What's up? What's up? The Nicholas Diorio stuff, when Nicholas Diorio did respond, um, that was kind of a bombshell because it puts, like, D-Max's timeline in jeopardy mm-hmm. on, like, what happened on that call. And then, like, on Peepaw Riveter's stream, uh, D-Max said he never asked for two, three point, uh, $3,000, 3.2K. Um, also, JFA going on Peepaw, that was fucking, like, to confront – uh, D Max on that one. That was you know what the funny thing is. He didn't even mean mean to like get an absolute dub on him. <laughs> he didn't even mean to. He's just like, yeah, dude. I just kind of wanted to ask him some questions. I didn't actually mean to like win. I didn't. I didn't know I won anything, dude. Oh my god. Mm. Okay. But, um, so yeah. So I think I think the next thing we move on to is uh Tony. I and mean, this is the last time I like I, I said this fucking my last stream, but I really genuinely hate talking about this dude so much. Who's Tony? Um, Tony flagging True. burn, bro. What the fuck, dude? Out of all the things, this may be actually be the, like the third time this has actually happened, but the the most significant time that has gotten most traction in the community. Um, 
How do you guys feel about that? Do you think Tony would stoop to the, these lows of lows to attack Burn? Yes. 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 <laughs> How about you, yes. Flatly, uh, yes. Okay. I said the um, word. I said the M word on accident. My bad. My bad. I don't care. Don't I mean, flag yeah, burn. True. Don't flag burn for and my this mistake. Is not the first time, but this is not the first time you flagged me. Okay. I know there's going to be like the retards in the fucking comment section. Like, actually, he didn't go to YouTube, on the YouTube website. Um, He didn't do a flag. I wouldn't put it past him because he's shown his flag history before. He has flagged about three to five of my streams from the YouTube channel. On, on YouTube.com, he has flagged my shit. Um, so him going to YouTube on Twitter, adding YouTube, sending him a clip, sending him a clip that's out of context, it doesn't even show the N-word. <laughs> um, no, I wouldn't put it past him. This is probably the fifth or sixth time he has flagged. Fifth? Jesus. Huh? I mean, uh, adding Team YouTube and all, that's a soft flag. It's not like actually going on the website, but it's still a flag. Yeah, but and I got the would... retards going. Oh, you still tried. I think it's the principle more than anything, right? Um, yeah. yeah. Yeah, no, like, he didn't flag, but he's a snitch. It's like, no, he flagged, and he's a snitch. And, and he well, provided a fucking clip. He provided a clip that was out of context. It doesn't even show Joe saying the N word. It's a nice flag. Nice job, retard. Get played. Get fucking played, you fucking dumb. Why would you try to hurt Burn over me saying something? Because because it was on my birthday. Because it wasn't no, it, when it, when it when it's never about Tony, he has to get involved and make it about him. So since it was my birthday, and of course I'm not gonna talk about Tony on my birthday. I'm actually having fun, uh, you know, playing games, with my friends, uh, doing you know good things on my birthday, which isn't stress inducing. Um, he comes into chat, talks his shit, which. You know, fuck it. You want to talk shit, talk shit. Um, but uh, escalate it by flagging me. Eh, you can go fuck yourself, buddy. Get yokai again, please. Cunt. Damn, bro. Actually, saying that, I was about to cut down the yokai stream here and it'll, uh, and put it out soon. So <laughs> good. I mean, yokai's a retard too, but fucking hell, I'm not going to defend Tony again. I'm not going to shoot myself in the foot. No, but I think it's gay that we do still keep bringing it up that we've done it. Like, at this point, we've stopped trying to defend him. I mm -hmm. think even trying to say, that well, we've done it, we've done it, yeah. Yeah, we have. I think most people know by now that we've tried to help Tony. And I, I guess it is kind of cringe that we try to armchair therapist him sometimes. But, like, what, what, what can we do when he's coming to us? And like crying about these things and we're trying to give him advice on how to like deal with it and he's just like oh no fuck you guys you're racist and it's just like well, then why did you come to us to talk about your your fucking problems like tony's not getting the medical help he needs and uh i'll be that guy that says it's not my problem or any of our problems if he doesn't get the help he needs uh stop platforming him I'm saying it right now publicly. I know privately we've all talked about it. Stop platforming, Tony. No more platforming of him. That's what he wants. That's what he craves. Stop doing it. The worst he could do is come into a VC and people mute him and don't give him the time of day. He'll go away. He'll move on in the next community. That's what he's been doing for years. Don't platform him anymore. It's that easy. Mm, crazy, bro. Oh, so, who do you think uh who do you think oh my god, my dog's barking. I'm about to sell her to a Chinese restaurant. Come uh, who, who won between Kendrick and Drake? Uh, Kendrick did. Let Kendrick them did. both shoot each other. Kendrick, what the fuck, Joe? <laughs> Wait, what? Is that how they a racial stereotype? No, that's how they settled it in the 90s when rappers had problems. They would just shoot each other. So go back to the 90s. No, I don't that, care. That, that, that was Diddy. Diddy killed them both. All right, let's not get into it. Diddy killed them both. Diddy killed Pop. <laughs> It'll I don't be. listen to Kendrick or Drake, so I don't care. Let them shoot each other for all I care. Uh, Tupac's still better rapper. Biggie's still better rapper. Gone too soon. Kisses. Yeah. This is fucking... That's it. That's it. That's all there is to it. Uh, Kendrick won, though. If you want my opinion, Kendrick still won. 
Let's go, W. Joe, on the right side of history, right here. I think you I know didn't what? All our points, other than the no, Will, no, dude, we're not. No, we're not going to go over this one. Dolph Cult being getting released. What do you guys think about that? Oh yeah. It, and wait, like, we're it, also it not. Like the fuck is Dolph? And why is there a cult? Looks like it's happening, bro. Is it? I, okay, I, I, I do find it funny that while I, I say do, this. Privately, I'm gonna say it again. I don't care. This drama. Uh, this yeah, I, I, I Dude, it's so don't fucking care. gay, bro. Everyone's been spurging out. It's so fucking gay. Mm. Yeah, I don't. Bro, I've I just been hearing dude. people freak out about it, and I'm just like, who, who the fuck? Well, who the? When the fuck is this? What the I, I don't fuck care. Is a dove call, bro. Like, <laughs> yeah, who the fuck is dove? Yeah, and I am where interested is in seeing cult? this video though, because if it corroborates well, no, other stories I've heard, I know there'll be a lot of motherfuckers that have been lying to me. Hmm. I also got to find it funny. He went on Twitter and was like, oh, this 17 minute segment took me six days to edit. Like, yeah. bro, could have just, bro, should have hired D Max. He would have gotten it. <laughs> <laughs> would have got that shit done in 19 hours. <laughs> Not six fucking days. And, um, maybe it's coming out. I don't know. I mean, his computer couldn't handle a 17 minute <laughs> edit, so I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? And, uh, Zana Spurg, what did Zana do? Zana just basically uh, baited, bro. Suicide baited and then uh, put stuff on the internet that did not need to be on the internet. Oh, like, yeah, at all. dude. Stop <laughs> suicide baiting. Nobody cares. Nobody cares. I thought it was a either. love interest from that, that TF2 thing she's in. Oh, she's yeah? Like Team Fortress 2, like, love simulator or dating mm. simulator thing? I don't even know. I think she found a guy on there, or because like the tweets are way too close to each other, mm. and she's like has her heart broken or something like that. Mm. And then she spurs out, "I'm gonna kill myself." Here's a little secret, girls. If you want to try to get a guy back, threatening suicide does not work, and it does not make him want to get back but with you. I love you. him. No, nope. exactly. Really, you love me so much. End it. <laughs> like oh Jesus. All right, bird. All right. <laughs> I'm just saying, if you're if you're sitting there baiting suicide to try to get a guy back, no guy wants to be with you. He's gonna go, oh that that bitch is crazy, and I want nothing to do with you. Bro, if you put a suspicious vest on and go outside, I'll go. <laughs> Burn! Don't you wear nothing but a vest? Don't you wear nothing but vest though? Yeah, but my vest. Your reflective not vest because he's special. <laughs> this motherfucker before we went on out orb, it was like, hold on, I gotta change vest. Give me a minute, and then fucking walked away to go put on a different vest. Dude, how many right. vests do you have? Probably up to twenty. I don't know. Jesus what? Christ. That's how many like hoodies I have. Jesus Christ! I love what vests. What's wrong with vests? And they're all green. They're all. What the? Oh, you don't even have a different colored vest. Well, oh my God! You buy the same fucking vest? Oh no! Yes. No, no. SpongeBob head ass, bro. That's SpongeBob. Same, oh, okay, same it's, outfit it's every day. It's not about, it's not about Khaki 20, pants in a green vest. Because see, every year they seem to fucking break somehow. So I got a new fucking. <laughs> I get a new vest. So then, then, then they don't sell them anymore until fucking until fucking uh, fall. I do the grave mistake of only buying one, and then they're out of fucking stock, and then the I want to fucking die. Grave mistake. Why yeah. don't you just Dang. buy something else instead of the same <laughs> no, thing? No, it has to be oh sleeveless. God. No, cunt. It has to be sleeveless. Two two pockets up in the chest area. Two pockets down here, and then hood. Bro, Wait, it's the same color. Is it, you're not even like, hey, you know what? It might be the same because vest, but at least if it's the same. If it, it'd be weird if it's. It's, it's called weird. messing with your. What you think? I buy like nine million of the same fucking button-up shirt. No, I have a gray one that I have three copies of because I got them on Fancy bulk. But I have like a million different button-ups. Three. Yeah, because yeah. I got them in bulk. There's a difference. I'm not the guy going back to the fucking Ralph's every year and going, I'm going to buy the same vest every single year. Okay. okay. Why would I want to okay. do, okay, okay, hold on. I got I got gr beautiful green or gay fucking or awful yellow. That's the only two colors these fuckers come in. I'm not using Yeah, because you're colorblind. You're colorblind. Oh, you can't buy any God. other color. Holy shit. Well, no, but, the, but that's the only two colors <laughs> this vest comes into, Kant. Go buy other vests. There's no, other brands. Regular, you brokey. No, you're brokey. No, you're I'm, brokey. Not, I'm not a brokey. Uh, 
Uh, these are twenty dollars. Okay, 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 this is good. Game. This is good, game, good, game. You're, you're okay, fucking okay. stupid. Okay. Do you, does, does anybody have anything else to talk about? Uh, uh, if not, then we can we can end up. Uh, Burns a Brokey. He buys the same vest every year. That's what I stand by. I don't uh, change. Yeah, my you mind. don't stand by shit. You are fucking snake. What no. about um, you? Are talking about local <laughs> life? We're talking about Zana Maggot. I don't yeah. know if you guys want to talk about that one. Uh, Tony uh, flagging Dove Cult Burns face. Reading out, reading off our whole fucking docket, dude. Jesus Christ. Well, we got to make sure we get all of our points. That's true. I think, I think we've got. Oh, under, uh, uh, Lyle Convoy uh, debated a lawyer. <laughs> and oh, 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 <laughs> Sleep. Sleep. Okay, I think I think that's all we gotta talk about today, guys. Well, guys, that's at least we tried. And if you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and subscribe to the homie flatly. Also, become a member if you can. Uh, you know, spare the extra five dollar bill, y'all. Um, yeah. So yeah, we'll catch you in the next episode. Peace.